Kimberly McIntyre and I am here today with Sandy Fern. We are here at Palmetto Olive Oil Company and we're going to talk about my absolute favorite thing to dress my salad with. Salad is an excellent way to get raw foods in your diet. I think a lot of people are afraid to use much olive oil um, and, and myself included, but I've been told by health experts that, you know, you're not going to gain weight from eating the olive oil. Mm -mm. We have used so much olive oil and we've all lost a lot of weight. Sure. Um, and so I've actually used more olive oil than I've ever used, you know, in my cooking and doing this and continue to lose weight. So people need to not be afraid. Not to use healthy olive oil. fats. It's but, so different. Right. And we actually need more healthy fats in our diet because they help to protect our bodies and make our cells do what they're supposed to do, know what they're supposed to do. The diets that scare me are the ones that have no oil at all. Oh, I know. And I, I have friends that have done them and their hair falls out. And yep. they have all kinds of different you know, skin issues and stuff and like that. Your body heart, needs, yeah, your body needs, needs oil, but it needs and to be healthy oil. oil. Yes, exactly. So I, my personal favorite is the garlic olive oil and the, just the traditional balsamic, although I love many of these. I probably could actually have one of everyone in here, but I would like for you to tell us what are the health benefits of the olive oil and vinegar as opposed to what you would just buy in the grocery store? Right, well, um, everybody is familiar with the word antioxidants. Um, and free radicals, because the antioxidants help fight against free radicals. Um, and of course, correct me on anything, because I mean, this is also this is your this is your wheelhouse <laughs> too. But um, so our olive oils are much much higher in antioxidants. Um, the phenols are phenols are a type of antioxidant, and the phenols are what we have the chemistry of. So when you come in, we can actually show you how many phenols are in each serving of each different olive oil. And in a grocery store olive oil, you might have 15 to 30. In our lowest, our mildest olive oils are around 200, and then they go all the way up to about 700, um, which wow. also, so that's, it, it, it's, that's increases the health benefits, it increases the smoke point, but it also enhances the flavor. So you're gonna have a whole lot more flavor in an olive oil that might be 700 phenols, um, as opposed to one that is for sure one is 15. <laughs> right. Yeah, Big so difference. so you can cook it at much higher temperatures. So it gives you a lot more freedom in cooking, but also when you cook with olive oil, you start to, um, to burn off those phenols. Mm -hmm. So if you cook with an olive oil that only has 15 in it to start with, you pretty much are not, not eating nothing. a healthy oil. Yes. You know, you're not you're not getting what you're looking for. If you're eating the olive oil to get a healthy oil, you're not getting it. If you start with something that's even 200, you're gonna steal at the end. Um, one thing I would recommend when you're cooking with the olive oil, instead of putting your oil in your pan as you're heating it up, mm -hmm. wait till right before you're getting ready to put your food in the pan and put your oil in. So less time. Less time on the heat. Retains the nutrients. Yes. Okay, more yes, nutrients. Exactly. Okay, that's good to exactly. know. That's something new for me as well. And I love your salad because it's got every color of the rainbow. It looks beautiful. Some of these I grew myself, I'm excited. And that makes it even better. Fabulous. <laughs> and she brought me some so to take home. We're gonna dish it up and we're gonna top it with my favorite dressings. And I'll be honest, for me, I put this in my supplement, like when I budget, this is in my supplement category because having something that's high in polyphenols, antioxidants, that is gonna pack a punch in the health of my body. And you had mentioned that um, we get some probiotics through these and through the balsamic vinegars. Right. And so they're also prebiotic, probiotic, good for gut health. And, and I like to encourage my clients, when you're going to have something that is so healthy, as far as all of these different um, vegetables in your salad, then let's top it with something that's just gonna boost that nutrient quality instead of backtrack. Because so many people that are using ranch dressing with MSG, a lot of them have high fructose corn syrup, right. unhealthy fats. Oil. Yes. oil. Yeah. So we don't wanna do that. In this way, you have so much variety in the different flavors that you can choose to make it work for you. Well, these so. flavors enhance the flavor of your salad yes. instead of drowning it or covering it up. Exactly. So that way you can really enjoy your vegetables and you're and, and you're not just covering them up or, or drowning them. Right. I think I, a lot of people that use ranch are not vegetable lovers to start with. I think you're probably But the right. more you eat the vegetables, the more your body craves them. Yes, and that the, mind and shift. Exactly. Yeah, we were actually created to crave this type of food, but because we have been 
over inundated with processed foods, our bodies have gotten used to that. So we can train our bodies to start to crave the things that we need um, for nutritional health. And this is a great way to start. Exactly. So exactly. we're going to dish this up and have a little lunch ourselves. And I want to thank you for listening. I want to thank you for having lunch oh, with me. Well, thanks and for bringing lunch. Yes, you are welcome. And you guys have a great day. Hi, everyone. Welcome to my kitchen show. This today. is Entire Healing. Um, we're at the oh. Palmetto Olive Oil Company. Can I eat that piece of cabbage? You're so and while we're that. eating our salad, I want to ask you guys, you know, like, what do you think? You want me to dish? Yeah.